So today on my first busking adventure, which went really, really well, and I've already done a video about that, but I just wanted to add this bit at the end, which um, I was playing the song which I'd written for my nephew, Alexander May, who died on 13th of March 2016. And um, I wrote a song to play at his funeral and at his tribute event, and, and I sang it today in the busking. And, um, and I introduced it as being for Alexander May. And then this is what Amy experienced at the time. <laughs> yeah, as soon as Alexa mentioned Alexa's name, I thought I was drawing and I sort of picked up on my sense, extra sensory perceptions. The spirit world open and Alex, I knew he was going to come down. I knew, I knew he was present and it felt, it felt like loads of spirits all there guiding him and then Alex turned up and he said oh this is it I'm here now and they were like yes yes this is you're here so he'd been on a journey to come and they guided him to the spot exactly when Alexa mentioned his name and sang his song so he was there enjoying the song swirling around um flying around above us and <laughs> I was drawing and and he remembered me from when I did the um the dedication on the radio station ah right yeah so so I felt like a bit of an anchor and Alexa was singing away and Alex was really happy and flying whooping and and then uh, I just kind of carried on drawing and Alexa was singing and then I heard her stop she stopped singing and she went oh the microphone has slipped and it was <laughs> Alex the microphone got knocked out of where it was it just went from here to here and I was like Rah! <laughs> trying to reach for it <laughs> <laughs> but to stop for a minute and then go back to it so we were laughing and I carried on singing and finished the song and then when I finished the song a white feather flew along the promenade into my guitar case and was like was. spinning around in a circle inside my guitar case Alex was getting lessons on how to move things in the physical world as I've witnessed many times in other people's spirit journeys that they sometimes come back to this realm so that they can learn how to manipulate the physical reality like moving things as a spirit i've witnessed this many times like you get in the film ghost when whoopi goldberg teaches patrick swayze to move the penny up the wall oh uh, right yeah yeah, yeah they oh. get guides they get guides to learn how to move things to assist their family and friends and people in this world so it's really important that you know you remember that and give your loved ones on the other side lots of encouragement and love and, and acknowledge them when they come around and do these things. Because Alex flew off. <laughs> he, he literally went, whoa, he's done his business. After the feather thing, he's like, whoa, he's really happy. Full of love, full of this amazing spiritual energy of happiness. This is Dixon. <laughs> ah. <laughs> well, you're on video, Dixon. So we... um. Had an experience of Alexander May today, coming in, helping with the music. Big love. Bye. Bye.